You only get these kind of questions about how things have developed when you get up there in years. So if you ask me what has happened over the last 20 years, then I realize that I've been around for the last 20 years, so that's not necessarily a positive thing. But, you know, as you may know, I trained in Scandinavia, and then I went to the States. So I've been privileged to have seen the developments, I think, on both sides of the Atlantic. And I would say that, by and large, Perio has been developing in response to patient needs, incorporating new technologies, incorporating basic science, and of course, the new reality that has become, you know, bread and butter in the periodontist world is this whole new uh, possibilities that implant dentistry has given us that didn't exist at the time I did my training. So, now, if somebody wants to be a little bit prophetic about the future, I would say that in all parts of science, we start seeing developments related to more personalized medicine. We, we realize that it's not one size fits all, and I think that we're increasingly trying to identify treatments that will be applicable to specific groups of individuals, uh, treatments that may be more beneficial in individuals with special needs, uh, in presence of comorbidities and so forth. So I think that the next 10 years, we're going to see a much more intense focus into customized and personalized solutions in medicine and periodontology in particular.